everything but us. Apparently we can come in through here. Francis, you need to stop pulling so much. We are way down upon the Sawami River. And it is a beautiful, it's a beautiful day. So pretty out here. I don't even have my phone. It's quite a ways north. What? It's quite a ways north. Oh, is it? Upstream. Recommend it. If you're ever in the... Oh. <laughs> um, if you're ever, I don't know, between Tampa and Tallahassee on the coast there, um, this is called Yellow Jacket RV Resort. And it's actually not on the coast, it's on the Suwannee River. And it's beautiful. We're just exploring now, so I can't tell you too much, but I love it. And looking on the map, it's not way down upon the Suwannee River. It's half down upon the Suwannee River. Yeah. From the looks of it. I The reason I booked it on the Suwannee River was for that right there. <laughs> Seriously. That he just did. And he exceeded my expectations, except for he didn't do it when we first drove in. And that's when no, I thought he was going to do it. Did not. Oh, there's the office. I see where we're going. Yeah. Fire engine? All right. Similar, I think, to the rest, probably like between sixty and eighty dollars a night. So on the the high side of yeah. things, yeah. Probably, I really don't remember. I have to listen. To I don't have my phone with me. I don't <laughs> what was that? Okay, so here, we're going to go the storage. Oh. If you just want to go camping for a week, this would be. If there were things to do, especially around, mm -hmm. I don't We just have to. That's a pool, by the way. Mm -hmm. I think it's a pool and a hot tub. I wish it was a pool. Open till nine if we wanted to do a little hot tub. 
It would. And I wouldn't have been able to get in there. I know. I thought about uh, that. Yeah, that would have been. Well, yeah, I would have just had to go straight and back it around. Yeah. Which I. That's the way you normally do it. So I guess I would have. Okay, as far as oh, I'm no, concerned. I don't want you know, she doesn't bite enough. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Is she pettable? Oh, yeah, that's Bailey. Oh, hi, Bailey. <laughs> My Francis would love you. <laughs> doesn't get prettier than this. It's so peaceful. We're out for a beautiful morning walk today at the Yellow Jacket Campground. Definite recommendation if you can get in here. We're here and it's pretty much empty, but it's October 16 today. And they say, like, within a few weeks, it's going to be packed. But right on the Sawani River. Incredible. Beautiful, but cold. How cold? How cold is it? Uh, it's in the low 60s, mid 60s, probably mid 60s. It's going to be a high of 69, which is high 60s. But I'm freezing. I, yeah, you are. Yeah, it's okay in the sun, but once right. we get in the shade, it's really cold. It's okay in the sun. Oh, I don't know, Swan River. Uh, we are up in. We're up here. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Wow. So is this, that a walking trail? And this right here is the Gulf of Mexico. It's not a bay. Right. It's like crazy. The Suwannee River just. Usually it seems like rivers dump into a bay. So are these trails? Huh? Drive. Don't drop your phone because it's not around I yet. know. I 
hate it when you drop your phone. It's the worst thing it, ever. It is. Have you ever? Uh, no. I see dog park. That's where we are going. Dog park. Ooh. The turtles. I like turtles. I realized that when I do the I like turtles thing, I also am thinking like the Idiocracy movie, I like muddy, and it's all sort of the same thing to me. So now I don't really know which one is which. Honestly, I like turtles. It is fenced in. Yeah. Woot, woot. <laughs> He's hopping. He's hopping like a bunny. Where's the door? Look at him roam. We'll see whether we can get him to run to us. So the deal is we've never been at a spot where we felt comfortable testing him off a leash. We, oh, there he goes. And so this is a spot we've been waiting. We've been waiting for a dog park where we can run him and see whether he'll come to us when we want him to. That's been the problem. And of course, he's hanging out with me. Want the ball? Come on. Good morning. We are leaving our absolutely fabulous campground. Absolutely beautiful. Roger has to do some finagling with the RV to get out of this spot, which it's really good that there's nobody across from us. Otherwise we might have some issues. I'm sure we'd figure out how to make it work, but he, he's going to back up and so he can make a nice Easy turn. I'm not gonna hit that tree that's hanging out there, am I? Uh, it'll brush. That's as far as I need to go. Okay, well you got plenty of room if you needed to go farther. So we got it all ready and we're ready to leave this place. We're just waiting for Mike and Betsy over there. I'm gonna walk over and see if they're ready to go. He doesn't need help. He doesn't want help. It's like, right, right. Like that would, even me talking to you right now is messing up your system. You are? You ready to go? So. I know. <laughs> Hey, this is the best campground it ever. Is. Yes, it is. Oh, you Don't see worry. Betsy. That's cool. right. Okay. Yeah, Betsy's like, right here. Watchy, you better I go say hi to him. He's going away. nuts. I'm not crazy about the skyway. Yeah. You're, you're gonna rub. That's amazing. Yeah. No, he wouldn't have been able to do it if somebody else was there. What have I done? Where 
so blessed and we count it such a joy and honor that you would share these memories with us we're back in sarasota we're going to take a little break we have some exciting news coming up and so make sure you are subscribed and that you click the bell icon so that you're notified as soon as we upload episode one of season two and with that We can't think of any better way to conclude season one than by simply saying, Shanks for the memory.